Webb's Depth of Knowledge. It has four levels. It is a collection of vocabulary words and skill sets for each of the four levels that you want to be familiar with. Level one is the skill level. So some vocabulary words to go along with that is identify, memorize, label, list. Not anything that requires really high level of critical thinking, but some essential skills that sometimes your students need. Level four is extended learning. So that means where they design, they connect their learning to something else. They're able to make an intelligent critique. A lot more challenging to do. Now, should our goal be to always level four web depth of knowledge? Absolutely not. Of course, students need to be able to memorize their math facts. We all need to be able to do math quickly. So there is always a use for knowing some basic tools and skills at a skill level. However, we can take that skill and always move it up web depth of knowledge, level two, level three, and level four, just based on the activity that we're doing. So we want students to memorize math facts, but we also want them to understand how to connect them to new areas. So we start with level one sometimes, and other times we're building on that. So always identify web depth of knowledge and know what level you are addressing.